The world today, as we all know, is moving faster and faster. And the problem is that we're, we can't have enough time to sometimes, we feel like we don't have enough time to really dwell and think about a decision as, as, as much as we would like. But I think that's okay. In fact, I think you can make good decisions quickly. The worst thing in business today, I think in any organisation, is to procrastinate. And most of us, you know, when I ask people in my workshops, they say one of the biggest faults is just procrastination. So here's a quick, simple tool that you can use to help you make decisions right now. So again, using my speed links um, terminology or framework, nine different possibilities and in two minutes. So if you're going to make a decision, what I um, encourage you to do is to say, in the first two minutes, write down, write, what are all the rational aspects of a decision? Say, for example, you were thinking of um, changing a career. Some of the rational aspects that you might write down might be you might earn more money, it might be greater career opportunities, it might be greater chances of promotion, it might be closer to home. So you write down those nine as quickly as you do, don't filter, just start, and then you've got the rational decisions, the rational aspects. Now look at the emotional aspects. So if you change your job or change your career, for example, the emotional aspects might be, well, what if it doesn't work? What will my neighbours say? You know, what if I'm, I'm not as confident? They're all equally important. And we know from all the research literature, although business likes to think of itself as a rational organisation and a rational structure, most of our decisions are based on our emotion. So, making decisions, make the rational stuff explicit, make the emotional stuff explicit, do them both in two minutes each, nine possibilities, and I guarantee in four minutes you'll make a wonderful decision and the days of procrastination are over.